Hi everyone, welcome. Uh, today I am going to be telling you the meaning behind some of my paintings. Now, I'm not going to do all of them because I do have a lot. And I used to have them all up on this wall. I took them all down because it was a lot and so I just left them up. I have this little like corner of my room where I just paint in and I like... I think you could see it in a couple of videos. I'm going to start with more of the older pictures and then go up, but I don't remember when I made what, you know? Okay. So this little, little, little one is the first painting I ever did. So let me give you a little background. So I used to, when I was younger, I would like doodle and then I would start doing drawings and I like, found, er, sorry, I like realized like, hey, I'm somewhat decent, you know, and so I like just practiced drawing for a couple of years, and then I was like, I, I, because my grandpa loves painting too, and drawing, and I always saw him, you know, painting, and so I was like, dang, I want to try that, so I was like, okay, I'm going to try, so I bought these pack of canvases, and there was two of these gold ones, and then two like rose gold pink ones i still have them when i first bought these i was like inspired to paint on them like do something cool but like now it's kind of like uh, they're not very uh they don't seem very practical to me now so they just sit up there but this is the only one i painted on and all i had was white paint and i painted a little heart like you can't really tell that's a heart but it's a little heart and these are supposed to be like plants or flowers coming out of the heart like here out of the like aortas is that what they're called i think so another thing i did was this painting so i love drawing ow that really hurt ow uh but i love drawing people and i also love painting people so, if you guys don't know who this is, this is Naruto from, uh, Naruto. <laughs> and it's not, it's like, I'm very, the thing about this though is I'm very proud of the eyes. Like, I feel like his eyes look so dope. But you can see, like, his skin, it's patchy and it's not the right color. But, like, I feel like just this part of the eyes is so amazing. The hair is pretty good, too. You know, his outfit's nice. Like, I really like this, though. I think I did a pretty good job for my first ever person painting. Next. Now I'm just going to start going out of order because, like, I don't know what I did next and everything. And I don't have all of them. Because, like, I don't know if I said this, but I'm not doing all of them today. I, but if you guys do enjoy this, I'll do the rest of them. If not, then, like, I won't. This one... This is my most recent one. It is from a album cover. I actually don't know what uh, album it is. Made it, but I made it in like my interpretation of it, you know, so it's not exactly the same, but it's somewhat similar. Here's a little close up of like the eye and stuff. The next one I'll show you is this one. This one's a little bit bigger than the rest. But just like a little bit. Uh, this one, it means nothing. Okay, it's it's just something I thought of. I was, okay, so I was drawing a person, right? And then like I was doing her skin and everything. And then I was like, damn, she looks good without a face. So I just didn't make a face. And I highlighted her, and then I was like, I want to make a pretty, pretty background. So I just did, like, fall leaves. But I feel like it's pretty dope. It's, like, different. It's, I think it's dope. Uh, then I have this. This is older, and this is just the Grinch hand. I don't really like it that much. Then there's this one. This one is also, uh, inspired from album cover. His name is, uh... Topaz Jones from the album I think it's called Toothache or something like that but in this album like that's kind of like that's supposed to be him but it doesn't look like him but I feel like the face just like in general looks like 
pretty decent. I'm really proud of like the scalp here that I did. Uh, I feel like his hands look nice too. Only thing is that I hate is the shirt because in the album his shirt is striped, but I couldn't do it, so I was just like, "Yeah, I'm not gonna do it. Like it's way too hard." So I just painted it black. This one, I don't. Sometimes I take like people's Instagram photos and like take them as a reference and stuff like that. So I think she was a reference, but I don't know, and I don't know who, like if it is a person or not. But I don't. I don't think it is. But I love her. I think she has like amazing detail on the face. And my one of my favorite things is like the earring and the ear here. I feel like that looks so nice. And like I feel like her face and mouth and everything looks nice. Her body. I feel like this cleavage looks a little funky, but so now these last two aren't very. Literally, what the hell was I doing with my lips? Very, uh, what's the word? Mediocre. But I just, I love this kind of flower, so I made that. And I just thought it was a cool background. And then the little, like, sparkles here have little sparkles in them. And there's a couple of them all around. And this one. This is just a bunch of paints. It's, it doesn't have a meaning. I just thought it was cool. So, that's the last one. My dad is standing outside the door. I don't know why, but like, I don't want to hear him talking to myself. You know what I mean? And then he'll just think I'm crazy. So I'm just going to whisper an outro. But if you guys, if you did enjoy the video, please let me know. If you want to see more because I do have a lot more paintings so if you want to see them and like I know these ones were pretty like um, I want to say maybe not my best ones they're not the most like uh, like my other ones I feel like are more creative and stuff like that so if you would like to see those uh, let me know in the comments below and I'll show the rest of mine in another video in a part two thank you so much for watching Toodaloo!